It's been quieter around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the eye full time. Hmm? Oh, sorry. Was just doing some math in my head. Trade the grabs with you. Hate to interrupt, but I have a favor to ask. Lot of equipment on the eye has reached the span's end. If we're going to find more artifacts further out, we need work done. Got the nods and signs from Sarah and Walter for the materials, but I need hands. Yeah, she's an old station. Be ready for retirement by the stretch of a human life. Took a lot of modifications to tune into the anomalies. Give you the down of it. Worried not all of the repairs we need will take. Compatibility across the years tends to fray. Need more than just the you and I. Ask around. A few constellations are already on their way up. Attention's glue is on the station monitors. Check with the others. Lend a hand? Grab a couple of wrenches and let's tighten this equipment down. That's done it. Go on. See who else needs some help. Setting up some software. Want to test the computer over there? Help Vladimir code up this system the first time. Scanning equipment needs to be installed. I could use your help. If you could help me install these parts. There seems to be a compatibility issue with the equipment. Gave up my room in the lodge so Andresia had a place to call her own. Everyone needs space to let their thoughts run solo. You call her the wrong wires. Station showing red. You see originally had all the tech filed and serialed. But we needed a little more of the oomph, so there's a slap dash of freestar parts and jewelry rigs. Expected a few of them to blow us short, but the fixing is going to take time. This is my fault. I will stay until it is corrected. No need for the martyr's clothes, but I'm happy to have the help. As for you, while we're giving the eye the swords, need to tip your ear on another matter when you got the time. Eager to help, if I can. Don't 
want to worry anyone, but we got more competition. Not Starborn, rival collector. Captain Petrov owns a salvager vessel called the Scow, runs it like a palace of novelties, and he's got a new prize in his collection. Reached out through my hand to hands to see if we can do an honest swap. He says the rock ain't for sale for any price. Think we're gonna need a crowbar and bag for this one. Left the life of a jack of bones behind myself. I know what I'm asking. But I see a clutch prize not up for the prime any other way. Not sending you lone hook on the job. I want Sarah with you on this one. You two will be foot to foot the whole way, so make sure you're ready. Catch a smile out there. I have things for you. Who let you on board? Thought Petrov was done hiring mosquitoes. Or maybe you're after something from the captain's collection. Yeah? What kind of salvage work you do? Ship? Ground battlefield? Or do you just sculpt the back alleys picking through trash? I hate running through a dead ship. Like sifting through a damn tomb. Not to mention the constant threat of explosive decompression. Keeps you on your toes. <laughs> You're all right, scavenger. Go on ahead. Petrov's got a whole little alien zoo in the back. He's asking for trouble with those things. But the locks on the cages are pretty high end. Thankfully.
strewn about all over. The good stuff's locked up in a vault for Petrov's own personal viewing pleasure. And before you ask, Petrov's the only one with the keys, so don't try bribing any of the crew. You just waste your money. Trade it for it. Some dusty hauling ore from the fringe. <laughs> Was glad when he left. It's all shakes and muttering. Fine. Just ignore me then. Trying to get us thrown into prison.
done that before. for you. You're lucky I'm busy. There's gotta be something to do around here. You just stole that. Visitors. Wadik, you didn't tell me we had visitors. <sighs> we have visitors. Excellent. Now that you've gone to all this trouble to get here, you should make yourself at home. Relax. Kick up your feet on the tables. I don't care they have scorch marks on them anyway.
The artifact? Ah, you must mean my latest curio. I have never seen anything like it. Intricate pattern details, a metal that feels soft to the touch, yet bears not one hint of wear or tear. Ah, you are out of luck, my new friend. I cannot part with it. I know, it's a fickle man who falls in love so easily. But what can I say? Mi amore. Tempting. I do love showing off. But my security team will have a heart attack. It would be against all those protocols that I admittedly told them to make. Oh, -ho, you do have a point. Really? How flattering. Hard to argue with that. Ah, very well. What's a quick look going to hurt, huh? I know. People look at me Enjoy and say, your Petrov, your whole scout. ship is a testament of splendor. Why do you need a special vault? Well, all I can say is that even the greatest collection needs its own private viewing area. Plus, between you and me, there are thieves everywhere. So I spared no expense. Every door between me and my treasures is painful. But that is the price of security, huh? Que sera? Just a bit further. This ship and I have been through some adventures, I'll tell you. I once collected salvage from a demo celestial class while it was exploding. The crew was scraping scorch marks and bits of metal off the hull. Got work to do. Weeks. And of course, there was the time I accidentally steered us into a UC Navy vessel after a particularly uproarious celebration of my latest acquisitions of fine art. But we were wedged perfectly between their two thrusters and were able to just kind of push them back into the star yard for repairs. Itself. Ah, beautiful, isn't it? The man who sold me this told me that it spoke to him. That holding it for the first time was like drowning in your own soul. Alas, I've held it several times and my soul is still breathing. Devoid of any such enlightenment. Why, yes, he did. Oh, no. No, no, no. I can't. This one is mine. And it's only fair to warn you. Hands off! I would hate to sour our new friendship by becoming the victim of piracy. We're not taking anything, unless you make things unreasonable for us. I'm afraid not. 
I'm easy in all things, except my collection. Then I suppose it's just a question whether my immeasurable love for my collection and my crew of hired cutthroats is enough to stop you. Go ahead. Make a move for the artifact. Let's see what happens. You've done an admirable job of trying to keep your cool. But I'm afraid the captain isn't going to listen to reason. Wait! I surrender! I surrender! Don't kill me! We give you our word. Done! Stand down, everyone. Let the nice pirate pass. Find anything useful? Yeah? Feel free to drop some stuff into my bag.
by. Oh, you're going to regret this. My friend is how we do things, James.
I hope you know what you're doing. Might as well take what we can. There's a huge difference between being prepared and carrying too much.
Vladimir. Vlad, come in. Come in. The eye's gone completely dark. I, I can't reach anyone on the station. Noel, Starborn, came out of nowhere. Vladimir, get out of there! He already left, said he was going to, uh, to the lodge. Andresia, uh, she's, she's still breathing, but oh God, all that blood. Hello, Constellation. Are you there? Who are you? What did you do to our friends? They call me the Hunter. And now that I'm here, your part in glimpsing the unity is over. I'm already on my way. Say goodbye to your friends. It won't be long. Forget about us! That starborn bastard is after the artifacts! You can't let him take them! Pack up the collection, move it somewhere they can't find it! Vladimir's right. We need to fortify our position before that starborn storms in. We move out once the artifacts are ready for transport. What about everyone on the eye? We can't leave them to die up there. I want everyone watching each other's backs. We're not losing anyone else today. I don't know how long it's gonna take to pack up the artifacts. I... I'll get started. Hopefully this will only take a few minutes if my hands can stop shaking. Everyone, find a place to sleep. Where? Do you really expect them to barge through the front door? Just don't stand out in the open, Walter. Could you all keep it down? I'm trying to work here. Walter! Are you alright? <laughs> <laughs> 